Just in Devers got you for a quick one there in the first. What would you think of the way the offense responded quickly in the bottom? Yeah, um, I was pretty upset coming off the mound there. That's just a pitch I know better than to leave in that in that spot. And then the answer with whatever it was, four runs. Um, I think that really set the tone for the rest of the game, uh, put the momentum in our favor, and it kind of never left. How much does that allow you to attack and not worrying about being too fine out there when they're able to put some runs on the board early? Yeah, I was able just to attack and get a bunch of quick outs, pound the zone, and for a guy who hasn't had the results going my way um you know it was nice to get those quick outs kind of flowing and just work through some innings like pretty quickly and cleanly were there adjustments that you made coming into this start that allowed you to, to get some better results there were some adjustments uh nothing mechanical it was more just about like understanding where my miss areas are so you know if i'm throwing a slider make sure i get it to the edge or off um you know don't back them up and leave them over the middle stuff like that um but it really wasn't anything too crazy after the second hit, though, it looked like a complete turnaround. You didn't. You got everybody out after that. Uh, did you make an adjustment right after that? Uh, no, I kind of stuck with the game plan at that point. I knew I felt pretty good. Uh, my pregame bullpen was really, really solid. Um, I thought the stuff was in a good place, so I kind of just put my foot down after that. Um, but I didn't like consciously change anything. You've won a lot of games this year, both you and the team, but did you need this one a little more than most? Yeah, I mean, I think me and the team probably. Uh, the past week's been a little bit of a challenge. We've played a lot of close, tough games. Um, you know, obviously playing Boston, it seems like we play them super close all the time, so it was nice to have, um, you know, a nice, relaxing win. Um, and, yeah, I mean, for me, the past month hasn't been easy, um, but, you know, I'm just going to keep my head down and keep working and doing the right thing, and hopefully the results keep coming. Jameson, from a pitcher's standpoint, what has made Matt Carpenter so dangerous this year? I mean, the slug. Um, I, I really don't know where to pitch him right now if I were on the other team. He's hitting breaking balls in the zone. Um, he's handling fastballs, and he doesn't chase a ton. So there's just not a ton of room for error. Um, it seems like you have to really dot you know, your fastball either up somewhere or down and away and hope you don't miss.